Hope everybody is doing well. I'm doing all right. I am doing an experiment tonight. Something similar to what I saw on Gilly Cube's channel with the figure eight, stretch it out and do a figure eight in a solid color. So that's what I'm gonna do. I showed the colors at the beginning. Most of them were custom blend colors, but I just put them all in a cup, except the black. And I'm going to hopefully pour in a figure eight. That is the inside of the cup. I'll just set it over here for a minute. Give it a torch. Inside of that cup is super pretty. There's cells in there too. So hopefully I have enough paint here. My figure eights didn't go so well, but that's all right. Let's see what we come up with. saw it and then I lost it. It's a big clump of something. Yeah, there it is. These are just paints that I'm using up that was sitting on my table. I mixed a few days ago. I haven't been able to find any gloves, so using dish gloves and as most gloves, they're too big on me, so they drive me crazy. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to work on the composition a little bit more. Make sure there's no more big lumps. off and then throw some of the black on top. Okay, so 
going to move that around some. I'm going to leave it right like that and I'm going to let it set for a while and then I'll bring you in for a close-up. Okay, so I messed with it a little bit more and I overstretched in some spots, but I like the concept. Of course, uh, anybody that knows me knows I don't really like orange. So. Kind of wished I didn't add that in there, but it is a nice contrast. Okay, so bottom right corner, bottom left. Top left. That's the part right there that I overstretched and don't like. Top right. But I do like the concept of it. I'm going to try it with some different colors and maybe make the black paint thicker because it's sinking and giving it the weird, like, ghosting around it. So, and I did not torch it at all. These are just natural cells from the way the paint was mixed. Um, it was Floetrol, Gluol, and a little bit of water for consistency. But let me know what you think in the comments below. Have a great day, everybody.